Welcome back to Team APS, and we're back with another Yugi's Legendary Dex 2 duel. So last time we had Yugi versus Joey, but this time we're gonna pit Kaiba versus Joey. So we're gonna open up the Blue Eyes deck, see what's in it, and uh, get to dueling. And if you love these duels, then like and subscribe, and check out our last duel if you haven't already seen it. And stay tuned for more Yu-Gi-Oh! content. Let's get to the duel. Okay, so we've actually been storing the decks inside of here after both of the duels, but uh, this is Kaiba, who has not been opened yet. So, I'll be playing it today. It feels like opening a structure deck blue eyes, to be honest, but I think that came out much sooner than this came out. This is from 2016. So we start with Maiden with Eyes of Blue, ultra rare. The Melody of Awakening Dragon, also ultra rare. I don't know if this is when this card debuted, but it's actually pretty good. It lets you get two big dragons to your hand. Oh goodness, Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon's in this. And you get three Blue Eyes in three different arts. So that's kind of neat. Uh, this is going to be a bit bricky to actually use, but okay. Dragon Spirit of White. Actually, one of the better ones is like the first kind of Blue Eyes retrain from, I think the set was Shining Victories. Kaiba Man, the White Stone of Legend, White Stone of Ancient, Protector with Eyes of Blue, Master with Eyes of Blue, Battle Ox, La Jin, Voice Raiders, so these are just Kaiba cards. Alexandrite Dragon, this would definitely be a card he would use if it was in the anime. Uh, Blade Knight, actually one of his signatures. If you don't have any cards in hand, or one or less cards, he gets attack. Uh, Ancient Lamp, Tiger Dragon, Kid Moto Dragon. If it goes to the grave, you can summon a dragon from your hand. In the Swamp to take the place of a fusion material. Rider of the Stormwind. And now the spell card. So we get Burst Stream of Destruction. This is a Blue Eyes attack spell. Beacon of White, Mausoleum of White, Polymerization, Enemy Controller, Shrink, Silent Doom, Ancient Rules. Cheat out of Blue Eyes with this. Straight in. Where art thou? Because there are a lot of level ones in here. The Eyes of Blues. Pot of Dichotomy. Three monsters with different types in your grave. Oh god. Fusion Substitute. Unexpected Die. Negate Attack. Final Attack Orders. I remember when Kaiba used this in the anime. Shadow Spell. Cloning. Fusion Reserve. Reveal the Fusion Monster in your extra deck and add one of the materials to your hand. And then add a Polymerization from Grave to Hand. Jar of Avarice. Oh, and a few extra, extra deck cards. Azure Eyes Silver Dragon is in here. A few things. And then First of the Dragons. So, this takes two normal monsters. Decent little selection, and of course, our Seto Kaiba token. Not gonna be like the last game where I had to play Exodia. Yeah, you're still gonna lose, though. All right, do. Here's my Normal hand. summon, uh, oh. Alligator Sword. Hey, this mighty lizard man can swing his sword so fast that it's more than a speed of sound. Now set mm. one card face down. It's got 15. Draw duelist. I normal summon my blade knight in attack mode. Ooh. If I have one or less cards in hand, it gets four in an attack. Oh, I have many cards in my hand though. <laughs> Enter battle phase. Blade knight's gonna attack your alligator sword. And I'll take 100 damage. I'm on the board. Set one face down in my turn. And I'll draw. I'll normal summon gear free the iron knight. Oh, Jesus. Yes, okay. 1800. Uh. All right. I'll move to battle phase. Gear free to attack Blade Knight. <sighs> Blade Knight's destroyed. I take 200. Now I'm on the board. Okay, duelist. And I'll end my turn. I draw. I'll normal summon my Kaiba Man. Uh oh. And I'll activate its effect. I contribute it to special summon a blue eyes white dragon from my hand. <laughs> Tribute Kaiba Man, Special Summon Blue Eyes White Dragon. Wow! Into right. the battle Let's phase, Blue back. Eyes. Attack Gear Free the Iron Knight for 1200 oh. damage. 1200, yikes. Your move, Duelist. I will draw. Wow, your ace monster so soon. I'm never bad, Wheeler. I normal summon Time Wizard. Oh god, that's back. <laughs> that's right. And I'm gonna activate. Time Wizard's effect. Oh, Jesus, it's tools. All right, so I gotta call it right, right? I'll call Tails. No! Yes. <laughs> All your monsters are destroyed. And I gotta take half their attacks. So yes. 250. Okay. Well. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> 
<laughs> you really get to see that, like, how awful Time Wizard actually, like, how much of a risk that was oh, for Joey. Where's my luck? Oh, my anime luck did now. Oh, God. <laughs> my turn. I draw. Oh, no. <laughs> Blue Eyes White Dragon attack directly. Yeah, that's fine. 3,000. Normal summon my maiden with eyes of blue in defense mode, or in attack mode, in, in main phase two. Your move duelist. Draw for turn. Set. Set. Now end my turn. I'll draw a duelist. Activate, where art thou? Oh my gosh. Since I control a face up level one monster, I can add a level one monster from my deck to my hand, but during the end phase, I'll take 2,000 damage if I didn't normal summon that monster. I'm gonna get the white stone of ancients. So I only I already have the only good eyes of blue, so. Normal summon, the white stone of ancients. So I won't take 2,000 in the end phase. But you will take my torrential tribute. Oh man, <laughs> really? I'm gonna destroy all of our monsters. Really, duelist? Took the bait. I thought I was safe. I my monsters are me. destroyed. Fine, duelist. I'll go to the end phase. But that means I get to activate the effect of my white stone of ancients. That is true. Once per turn in the end phase, if it was in the grave because it was sent there this turn, I can summon a blue eyes monster from my deck. So I'll use the white stone of ancients to summon a blue eyes monster. Guys, if you can't tell, I'm still very much. Say hello. Oh, I'm going to do some cool stuff, duelist. I special summon the blue eyes white dragon. You gonna do cool stuff now? Later. Oh, okay. Your move. Draw for turn. I will set a monster face down and end my turn. I draw a duelist. You face my blue eyes white dragon once, but are you prepared to face my ultimate creature of destruction? I activate the white stone of ancients effects in the graveyard. I can banish it to target a blue eyes in my grave and add it to my hand. Oh my god. I banish the white stone of ancients to add this blue eyes white dragon. You're not a gonna Back to my You're, hand. No way. Now I'll activate polymerization. Wow. I now fuse together my blue eyes white dragon, the blue eyes in my hand, and king of the swamp. I think I can work doing it. Yeah. I can substitute it for one fusion material monster. They all combine to make... The Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. Was it necessary? No. Is it fun? Yes. I'll also activate Mausoleum of White. It doesn't do anything, but... It has text on it, that's all I know. Enter battle. Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon, Neutron Blast! Alright, All right, you're moving. Alright, draw for time. There's no hope of defeating my Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. What are you scheming over there? I'm Why are you nothing. smiling, Wheeler? I'll set a monster face down and end my turn. Draw! Now I normal summon my Battle Ox. Enter battle phase, Battle Ox attack your face down monster. Now my Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon Neutron blast him to the next century! Uh... Summon my next Blue Eyes monster and terrorize you and end your dreams, Wheeler. I'll go first this time. Oh, dude. Set one monster face down and one Stellar Trap card in my deck. I draw. Oh my. Lord. Woo! It can't be that. Alec. Woo! This deck. This hand is nothing. Your oh, move, Duelist. Okay. I'll mirror your move. Now, draw for turn. Command Knight. So all my warrior monsters will gain 400 attack. And you cannot target this card for attack. Okay. Well, if I control another monster. Okay. And then I'll normal summon. Valkyrian Knight. Uh, I don't know what her deal is. So, you cannot target face up warrior monsters for attacks except for my Valkyrian Knight, which is redundant because Command Knight already essentially says that. But uh, when, this, when this card is destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard, I can banish a, a warrior from my graveyard and then target a level 5 or higher warrior from a graveyard and special summon. Okay, so a lot of nothing. But it's also gaining the 400 from my Command Knight. So it's 23, and she's 16. That's right. Got it. And now, 
Enter battle. Battle entered duelist. Valkyrian knight will attack your face down. You attack. My ancient lamp! So, before damage calculate, it's gonna get destroyed, I think. Knight. So it's attacking your command knight now, instead of this. Command knight is destroyed. Yes, and you'll take 700. And my ancient lamp gets to live, although now I won't be able to do that again, because it's face up. Main phase two, I'll set one card phase down, now in my turn. I draw. Uh, how much attacks did I have? 19? 19. No, oh, well, I had a cool thing. I will activate my Ancient Lamp's effect, Duelist. What else does it do? I can special summon La Jin, the mystical genie of the lamp, from my hand. Genie has come out of the lamp, <sighs> Duelist. I mean, it's only 1800, so. It is only 1800. Does it also have an effect when La Jin's on the field, or? No, actually. Oh. Now, enter the battle phase. Okay. La Jin's gonna attack Valkyrian Knight, and during damage calculation, I'll activate my Shrink card to shrink Valkyrian Knight's attack in half. My Shrink, We'll cut your monster's attack to 950. Goodbye, Valkyrian Knight. I don't have a level 5 or higher to actually use. So you'll take 850 damage. Set a card face down and in my turn, Duelist. Alright, I draw for turn. Pass. You pass, Duelist. I draw, Duelist. Screw it, this thing will die soon anyway. Switch Ancient Lamp to attack position. Attack for 900. Gotta take it. And attack for 1800. Yep. Your move. Draw! Normal summon Dark Valkyria. Okay, Duelist. It's a Gemini monster, so it doesn't have an effect. Yeah. But it is equal to your La Jin. That's true. I'll have my Dark Valkyria attack your Ancient Lamp. It'll be destroyed. I'll take 900. <laughs> and then main phase two, I'll set one card phase down and end my turn. Draw, Duelist. I, I'll activate the Melody of Awakening Dragon. I'm gonna discard Pot of Dichotomy. I get to add two dragon monsters with 3,000 or more attack and 2,500 or less defense to my hand, which in this deck is literally only blue eyes. Two big bricks. Oh, this is gonna potty again, Jesus. I'm not, I don't have that. Good. I'll get two blue eyes white dragons to my hand, wanting to maybe be able to summon one since you killed my mystical genie. Oh, the genie's still here. Or my, you killed his lamp. It's he attack. It's a counter, and that gives it attack, and it can destroy something. It's like Breaker. I'll enter the battle phase. La Jin's gonna attack Dark Valkyria. He activated my trap card. Kunai with chains. But what if I use my shadow spell? What? And I target your Dark Valkyria. It's going to reduce her attack? It'll reduce her attack by 700. I have to activate Mystical Space Typhoon! Targeting oh, your Shadow man. Spell. Oh yeah, because we're still attack declaration. Shucks! Alright, my Shadow Spell is going to be destroyed. So now La Jin is destroyed and I take 500. Yes! Oh man, okay. Well, your move, Duelist. My move, you say? Your move. You got lucky on that one, that's all. During the end phase, I'll activate my Call of the Haunted. Targeting Valkyrian Knight. Okie doke. Summon to the field. Good boy. All right, draw for time. Attribute them both to summon. Phoenix Gear for Oh, I thought you were going to summon Red Eyes Black Dragon. No. I was going to be like, oh man, okay. This is way better. It's got more attack, oh, yeah, this you see? Too. It's got more attack. So what's he do? Uh, he's a Gemini, so nothing. Okay. Until I activate Supervise! Oh, you need to be supervised by so an adult? I'll equip my Gear Free with Supervise, so now it, can, uh, it has access to a Gemini effect. Which reads... If your opponent activates a spell card, I can target a Gemini monster in my graveyard and special summon it. During either player's turn, when a, this is a quick effect, during either player's turn, when a spell or trap card is activated that targets a card on the field, I can send a face-up equipped card I control to the graveyard and negate the activation. And if I do, I'll destroy it. Oh, gates. man. We got the gates. Jeez, okay. And now, I'll enter battle. Battle entered. Phoenix Gear Freed attacks for 2,800. I'll have to try negate attack. You declare an attack, I'll target your monster, negate it, and end the battle phase. Well, because you just activated a uh, spell or trap. I'll use Gear Freed's effect. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna send the supervise and special summon out Dark Valkyria. Okay, so your attack goes through. 2850, I mean 2800. 
And Dark Fakiri attacks for 1,800. Yeah, this was not a good game. And now, I'll end my turn. Alright. Part of the cards. Draw. Now I need Jack Mask back. Game can three! Ultimate <laughs> Dragon again! See, see? I wish. I have Beacon of Light and Rider of the Storm Wind. I'm gonna start by activating Unexpected Die. Oh. Since I control no monsters, I can put something to level 4 or lower normal monster straight from my deck. Say hello to my most powerful normal monster that you haven't seen yet. The Alexandrite Dragon. That's a real monster. Attack mode. 2,000 attack. I respect it. The Tsar's Lost Jewels can be found in the scale to this priceless dragon. And now, I will set one card face down and end my turn. All right, then. Draw! I set a monster face down. Then I'll set two Speller Traps face down. And I'll end my turn. Well, I'll draw. Alexander Dragon attack is face down. You hit Keeper of the Shrine. Ooh, 2100 attack. You take 100 damn. 2100 body. Okay, I'm gonna, I'll set one card. Anyways, you're moving. I will normal summon Gemini Summoner. Okay. It only has 1500 attack, so I'll end my turn. Normal summon my Vorse Raider in attack mode. Yipes! This wicked beast warrior does every horrid thing imaginable and loves it. That's not, that's not right. That, that's not That's horrible. his flavor text. That just sounded terrible. All right, duelist. Enter battle phase. Alexandrite Dragon, attack Gemini Summoner. I'll activate my phase down. Roulette Spider! <laughs> okay. So, uh, we're gonna roll a die and then we're gonna apply whatever get the result is. Four. So I will choose one other monster you control and change the target to it and perform that damage calculation. So now it's attacking your Alexandrite Dragon. Well, I was attacking with Alexandrite Dragon. Now you're attacking your Vorse Raider. Okay. <laughs> Bye, Vorse Raider. You did this to me once, I do it to you. Uh, <laughs> man, screw you, Roulette Spider. Let's go. I end my turn. During your end phase, I can use my Gemini Summoner. I can pay 500 life points. Yay, I'm winning again. And then I'll normal summon or set a Gemini monster from my hand, or normal summon one face up Gemini monster. I can normal summon Red Eyes Archfiend of Lightning. Oh, you gotta tribute summon that, right? Oh, I guess so. Wait, wait, wait. I guess so. Yeah, okay. You have to... Yeah, it doesn't say without tributing. Okay. So we'll tribute. We'll tribute the Gemini summoner. Oh, Red Eyes Archfiend of Lightning. That's right. Well, I'll end my turn. Yeah. All right. Draw for turn. Now I'll Gemini summon my red eyes. Ugh. Fine. And I'll use my Archfiend's effect. I'll destroy all your monsters with defense lower than its attack. Goodbye, Alexander. Rude. And now I'll normal summon. Well, you already normal summon. Oh yeah, that's right. That's a Gem no. Gemini summon. Don't you love this mechanic? It's, it's Gemini's very, are great. It, 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 it just stalls you out. It's kind of annoying, but fine. Enter battle! Battle, enter duelist. Red Eyes, Archfiend of Lightning, attack! I take 12. Yeah. Might be, I take 25. There we go. I don't know what happens, okay. All right, and I'll end my turn. Draw. Okay. I'll normal summon my White Stone of Legend. Okay. Activate enemy controller. Now I'll input the code. Left, right, A, B, start. Tribute my White Stone of Legend to take control of Red Eye's Archfiend of Lightning. It's mine now. And that also means that my White Stone's effect activates. Since it went to the graveyard, I add Blue Eye's White Dragon to my wow, hand. he just avoided the real Blue Eye. Broke Neck Blue Eyes will never be in my hand by choice. Add Blue Eyes to my hand. Activate. Silent Doom. I target a normal monster in my graveyard and special summon in face-up defense position, but it cannot attack. Red Eye's Archfiend of Lightning's effect destroy all your monsters with less defense than my attack. Attack for 25. Uh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to tribute these for blue eyes so badly. All nope. right. Draw for turn. All right, we'll activate uh Archfiend of Lightning's effect to destroy Voice Raider. This thing gets deadly the longer it stays <laughs> in the field. As we take turns using it. Oh. And then our normal summon, Alligator Sword. Sword attacks for 1,500. And Red Eyes attacks for 2,500. That's 4,000 damage. Yeah, yeah. But I gotta end my turn. I draw. Activate Ancient Rules. 
According to the old, outdated, ancient rules, I can summon a level 5 or higher normal monster from my hand. Say hello to the blue eyes white dragon. You have so many ways to cheat those things out. I do. Enter battle phase. Blue eyes white dragon. Attack alligator sword. I'll take 1500. 15. I will draw. Let's. Uh huh. Running scared, are we, duelist? A true duelist fights with strength. And set a trap or spell face down. And I'll end my turn. I'll enter the battle phase, duelist. I'm going to attack your face down monster. Hit. Actually. Next, I'll set my own card face down, and in my turn. I'll activate Return of the Red Eyes. So as long as I control a Red Eyes monster, I can target a normal monster in my graveyard special summoning. Wow, okay. So I'm just going to target my Alligator Sword special summoning. Okay. Wow, rude. All right, anything else? No. Draw for turn. Use my Return of the Red Eyes. Yeah. I, can, I have a Red Eyes, so I'll target and special summon Actuator. Okay, it's there. I'll set a card face down and I'll end my turn. Draw, Duelist. Normal summon La Jin, the mystical genie of the lamp. In Ooh. attack mode. Now, into the battle phase. Blue Eyes White Dragon's gonna attack Red Eyes Archfiend of Lightning with 3,000 attack points. We're turning off that return of the Red Eyes. The Red Eyes will never return. Oh, you would think that, wouldn't you? Mm. So I'll take 500, right? And I activated my hand, Red Eyes Retro Dragon. Oh boy, what's that? So if a level seven or lower Red Eyes monster is destroyed by your opponent's attack or card effect and sent to the graveyard while this is in my hand, I can special summon this card in defense position. And then I can special summon as many of those destroyed cards to the field. Oh, for Christ's sake. Welcome back, Red Eyes Archfiend to fight me. Man, oh. <laughs> Well, La Jin, yeah, I'll attack Red Eyes Retro Dragon. Okay. And I'll use the effect of my Keeper of the Shrine. Yeah, yeah, he's back. Special summon. Oh, this duel will never end. That's okay with me. Your Moon Duelist. I will draw. Got so much going. Why should it ever stop? Does Keeper of the Shrine ever go to get banished? I don't think he I don't does. Think he's so. weird like that. He, just, he, he can repeat this all day. So I'll let him. I'm gonna use him as two tributes. For my Red Eyes Black Flare Dragon. Interesting, okay. 2400. Ooh, that's trouble. Now, it doesn't, it, it, it can't Gemini summon it, because I just summoned it, but I will move towards battle. Battle is okay. Archfiend of Lightning will attack your Lajin. All right, so he is 25. So I'll take 700 damage. Oof, dangerous. But I cannot fight your Blue Eyes, so I'll end my turn. All right, draw for turn. I'll enter the battle phase. That's scarier. So I'm going to attack Red Eyes Archfiend of Lightning with my Blue Eyes White Dragon. All right, so you'll take 500 damage. Yes. I'm going to set a card face down in main phase two. And now, normal summon Master with Eyes of Blue. Uh oh. When it's normal summoned, I can target a level one light monster in my graveyard and add it to my hand. Who's the target? Let's target White Stone of Legend. Okay. So it gets added to my hand. Then we'll activate, or not activate, we'll Synchro Summon. Whoa! Master with Eyes of Blue and Blue Eyes White Dragon. Synchro Summon to make Azure Eyes Cinnamon Dragon. So, once it's been summoned, all my dragons that I currently control can't be destroyed by card effect until the end of the next turn. Mm. And then starting next, uh, one of my next stand, starting on my next standby phase, I'll be able to summon normal monsters in my graveyard. Duelist. I'll use my return in the red eyes. Okay. I can control our red eyes. I'll target special summon my archfiend. Okie doke. Draw for time. Ah, don't look at that, right? Then I will Gemini summon my flare dragon and enter battle. Battle enter duelist. I attack your eyes, your eyes. I activate a trap. Negate attack. I'm not taking that burn damage yet, duelist. That's fair. All right. It negates your attack and ends the battle phase. All right, time to turn this duel around. I draw. I draw. During the standby phase, I'm activating the effect of my Azure Eyes Silver Dragon. Oh, yeah. I can target a normal monster in my graveyard and special summon it. So say hello to the Blue Eyes White Dragon. Big torrential tribute. 
Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. Did not love this. Didn't want to have to do it, did ya? Well. Could have just taken the burn. But here we are. Ah, oh, they're destroyed. I really needed that to work. So I can activate Keeper of the Shrine here. I did not realize that. Wow, really? Yeah, I thought it was supposed to say your opponent's card effect, but if a face-up dragon type monster it leaves the feet is sent to the graveyard by a card effect, okay. I can special summon it. Okay. And then if it was a normal dragon, I can add a normal a, dra a normal monster from my graveyard to my hand. Oh jeez. The deck never ends. Alright. Well, I bet you thought that you'd pulled off something good, huh? And Duelist, well, you know what? I mean, I got rid of a Blue Eyes and an Azure Eyes. At, at a great cost, but... I normal summon my White Stone of Legend. This man never stops. In my main phase. Activate Master with Eyes of Blue's effect in the graveyard. So, I can shuffle it from my grave into the deck, target an effect monster I control, send it to the graveyard, and if I do, I'll special summon a Blue Eyes monster from my grave. Other than a Scent monster. Oh, okay. So, he gets shuffled back in. Yeah, I'm out here. This goes to the grave, and I'll summon back the Blue Eyes White Dragons. And because my White Stone of Legend went to the graveyard, it also will add a Blue Eyes from my deck to my hand. Oh, nope. enter the battle phase. Lame. Blue Eyes will attack the Keeper of the Shrine. I will draw! Duel's gone down to the wire, but if you take one more attack from my Blue Eyes White Dragon, that's it, Duelist. Yeah, that wouldn't be good. That it wouldn't, wouldn't be. would not be good. Wouldn't be great. I'll activate Foolish Burial! Let's send my Black Stone of Legend. I guess I might as well go ahead and use my uh, Black Stone's effect. I can target level 7 or lower Red Eyes monster in my graveyard, Archfiend. Shuffle into the deck, and if I do, I add the stone to my hand. Okay. You know, we're just here, man, doing doing card game things. Both of our stones are being used. Got a real set of stones over there. All right, is that all duelist? A monster face down, and I'm in my turn. My blue eyes will attack your face down monster. You hit my gear freeze. Oh, I thought, I thought about a bit of the redstone. Your move doors. Draw for time. My white lightning is going to destroy you. You wish. Prepare to get blasted by the white lightning attack. You can blast me all you want, but you can't take my pride. Duelist will come out on top of this weirdly intense game three. Normal summon the Black Stone of Legend. And I use this effect, I'll tribute it to special summon level seven and lower red eyes monster from my deck. A okay, A okay. We'll get Red Eyes Black Dragon. Mm, okay. So they both found their way out in the field by the end anyway. They did both find their way. Yeah. Red Eyes versus Blue Eyes. It's what you clicked for. This is this is why you're here. You don't. It doesn't feel like it is, but it is. So now you have to actually like the video and subscribe. Mm -hmm. This this is we where delivered it comes on out. the value proposition. We did it. We, so it, it took a while, but we did it. Some camera issues later and many a back and forth exchange, but the red eyes be dragon and the but blue eyes white dragon. Now, Mom. All right, I'll activate my red eyes return. It's a special summon a normal monster from my grave. Ugh, I gotta fight my way through all these things. Come on out, alligator. Alligator sword. My red, as you know, my red eyes is not bigger than blue eyes, so I'll end my turn. I mean, I got enough life points to take one uh, hit from Blue Eyes. Well, let's hope so. We're going to enter the battle phase, Duelist. Uh, before you leave the main phase, I'll use my return to Red Eyes. Okie doke, Duelist. I'll target the Axe Raider. We're going to attack the Red Eyes B Dragon. All right, he will take 600. 600 damage to you. And then I'll activate Keeper of the Shrine. I'll set a card face down and end my turn. All right, draw for time. It all comes down to whether or not you can get this last bit of burn damage before I deal 1,900 to you. It's easier said than done. It's easier said than done, indeed. You're gonna die soon. Duel gets like weirdly dark and it's, aggressive. Yeah, real, it's, weird, it's strangely aggressive. I'm, not, I'm gonna beat you in this duel. I'm gonna kill you, I'm going Wheeler. to murder you. It's I'll like, paint okay. the city red with your blood, Wheeler. It's like, okay, leave that. What turn is it? If you're I watching could... at this point, leave a comment. What turn is it? Yeah, we are genuinely curious. It's we been don't a while know. on this. We don't know. We're game. a little scared. We don't know. Yeah, there's, a, there's some concerns. All right, let's tribute Axe Raider for Jinzo. Ooh, Jinzo, you say. That's 2,400 attack. 
Interesting decision. So no trap cards. You're really upping the stakes now. Okay. I'll enter battle. Battle enter. Jinzo attacks your face down. <laughs> Big mistake, duelist. You attacked my Kidmoto Dragon, which activates its effect. If it's sent to the graveyard, I can special summon a dragon monster from my hand. Special oh my summon. god. Say hello to the broke neck, blue eyes, white dragon. I'm locked into dragon monsters for the turn. Oh, that's fine. I mean, you don't, you don't mind that. Or even conduct the battle phase this turn. Hey, Jeez, I really got to use it in your turn. turn. Golly, okay. Ooh, that, that's not good. All right, I end my turn. Oh, that helpful. But activate my mausoleum of white. That is certainly a card. It is. So during my main phase, I can get an extra normal summon of a level one light tuner. Won't actually be using that. But I will target a face-up monster I control, send a normal monster from my hand or deck to the graveyard, and the targeted monster will gain attack and defense equal to the monster's, the sent monster's level times 100. Oh, okay. You got so, some giant in there? target blue eyes white dragon. I see. Yikes. Well, actually, I'm just going to send my battle ox for now, which will give my blue eyes 400 attack. Put him at 3,400. 3,400. All right. Blue eyes white dragon's going to attack your Jinzo. I'll take 1,000. For 1,000 damage, puts you down to 900, 600 to 900, Wheeler. I'm going to attack Keeper of the Shrine. Goodbye, my Keeper. Draw for turn. I've got two blue eyes on the field, Wheeler. What are you going to do? I'm going to activate Cards of the Red Stone. Okay. So I'll send a level 7 Red Eyes monster from my hand to the graveyard. Let's go ahead and send this, uh, this Flare Dragon to draw two cards. Now you'll need it. Ash Blossom. I do think I'll need it. All right. Well, I've sufficiently drawn out of this situation. Oh, man. No, I haven't. I, uh, I, oh, I, man. I definitely have not. <laughs> <laughs> Are you ready to lose the ultimate way? Oh, my God. I've been waiting so many turns for this, but it's going to be even better than you think. Activate. Burst Stream of Destruction. Oh no! Since I control Blue Eyes White Dragon, I'll destroy all monsters you control. Blue Eyes Ultimate oh, Dragon God. to the field in attack position. Now my Blue Eyes enter the battle phase and attack his life points directly! Scapegoat. I'm gonna make four <laughs> sheep tokens. <laughs> Fuck you, Wheeler! <laughs> well, you've destroyed one of my scapegoat tokens. <sighs> This is supposed to be my victory. You can still win here. I mean, your I mean, not now. move, Wheeler. But in time, you can win. Your move. Draw for turn. This is a card. It's not a useful card. That's what I wasted everything on that, Wheeler. I, look, I did not. No one told you to do that. That's true. <laughs> That's but... on you. You can't run forever, Wheeler. Normal summon the black stone. Got it, Wheeler. I'll activate its effect, attribute it, and special summon a level 7 or lower Red Eyes monster from my deck. Okie doke, Wheeler. And there's literally only one in my deck. I'll activate Return to Red Eyes. I now have a Red Eyes monster. I can special summon a normal Red Eyes monster from my grave. Or a normal monster from my grave. I'll get the Red Eyes Black Flare Dragon. Tribute the Retro Dragon to summon my uh, Archfiend of Lightning. Activate Polymer as a. He had okay. to be a normal monster. You see my penalty. I see. I see what you're doing, Duelist. We'll get the Archfiend Black Skull Dragon. Ah, screw it. I pass. I draw. Enter battle. Wow, this would have really freaking helped. I had just your final attack orders. Enter battle phase. Attack the Archfiend Black Skull Dragon. Boom! Uh. Like, all in all, like, it's fine. Buy this product. I mean, you can get a Blue Eyes deck, so. No, you really can't. And if you buy, and if I you. I mean, it'd be literally be better to buy the Blue Eyes structure deck than this. Like, but hey, you could also get a Red Eyes um, Gemini um, Chance, yeah. um, Blue Flame Swordsman randomly being in you here. You get tokens. All right, it's gonna be it. We'll see you guys in the next one. Pass, Pass turn. turn.